The story on many people's minds tonight is the holiday weekend. It begins tomorrow for a lot of us, but enjoying it could be a hassle. Our Katie Crow, they're live along the lakefront to show us how people are preparing despite the challenge of a bus strike. Katie. Yeah, Carol and Steve, the lakefront is going to be filled with thousands of people tomorrow. Families are gearing up tonight and also law enforcement is preparing for Milwaukee's busiest day of the summer. They come prepared to stake their claim for prime fireworks watching real estate. This year, there's even more reason to get a spot early. And especially with Summerfest and the bus strike and everything, and it's going to be real crazy tomorrow. So tons of people. We just wanted to make sure our kids were comfortable and we could all have a good time. Keep Nothing's you. going to keep us away, not even the rain like last year. These diehards say pitching the tent tonight is a must. Because public transit is not an option this year, more people will be driving and filling up parking lots early. So it's going to be really congested and busy. Extra police and sheriff patrols will be working to help ease that congestion. We're going to have 22 motorcycle officers working, um, and that's not even counting the officers that are going to be downtown almost on every single corner. Lincoln Memorial Drive will shut down as soon as parking lots are full. And starting between 7 and 8 p.m., the Hone Bridge will be closed in both directions until after the fireworks. The key is to be patient and alert. There's going to be a lot of pedestrians, so watch where you're driving. I understand people are going to be looking for parking spots, but they have to be cognizant of everything going on around them. So watch for all the pedestrians. There's going to be tons of bicycles and a lot of kids, so just be safe when you're, when you're driving. And police recommend you get here as early as possible tomorrow. Carpool if you can and have a backup parking plan just in case. Also, there will be increased OWI patrols all through the day and night tomorrow, so do not drink and drive. Reporting live from Veterans Park, Katie Crowther, today's TMJ4. I hope those campers have heavy sleeping bags tonight, Katie. Thanks so much.